Hello, I'm Blizznub, and welcome back to FTL and the Voyage of the Doom Mower. Now, we're heading into a slug-controlled nebula, which... Yeah. Uh, so the slugs that live in the leisure center of civilization. More currency and more time in which to spend it on extravagant ventures. I, l I like the slug people, you see that? You know, that doesn't sound too bad. It's, you know, it's a bit extravagant, but hell, it'll work. I have intruders on board. Well, crap. <laughs> um, where are, they've turned off my med bay. Now that's that's bad. Oh, that's very bad. Okay, it's fine. What we're gonna do is beam aboard their oxygen room and turn that the hell off. Because there's nothing they can do about it. That's not linked to the rest of their ship. Um, shit. Okay, I really need that life beam to not- Oh, crap. This is gonna sting. I just hope they don't hit the med bay. Oh! They only hit one room? Wow, okay. Let's beam you guys back. Beautiful, okay. Need to do that again. I don't know how many crew members they have aboard, but they're going to be running awful low on oxygen in a minute here. Come on, I need to hit that once more. Perf. Crap, they didn't turn off the glaive beam. Alright. Beam over, beat the crap out of them, and suck all the oxygen out of that room. Ah, oh, that stings. If that had hit the med bay, I'd have two dead crew members. Break it, break it faster. Come on, Valyria and my translation device. Break it like you mean it. Don't care if they keep shooting me with the ion cannon. It really does not bother me. In fact, you, Mag Magnus, Magneto, get back on the shields. Actually, I don't think ion helps you level up your shield skill, so, meh. No, it doesn't. Oh, well. Oh, thank goodness the med bay's back on. Alright, let's heal up these guys and beam them back. And George and you. And you guys need some healing too. Eventually I'll get the um, reconstructive teleport augment, which is oh, just so good means that your crew is fully healed whenever they teleport to or from a ship, so. So, so good. But anyhow, for now, let's just continue onwards. Um, yeah, let's go here, why not? Wouldn't mind hitting up a store, actually. We're doing really well on scrap. Speak of the devil. Now, what I need is guns. Glorious guns. They don't have- ooh! Burst- I don't like the Mark III, it's not as good as a pair of Mark IIs, but at the same time, that would help me. Um, then again, so would a lot of things. Um, <laughs> and I actually can't equip the- uh, you see, the problem with the charge, the, the Mark III, is it fires five shots. But it's a charge time of 20 seconds, whereas the Mark II is 12 seconds for three shots. So a pair of those is so much better than the Mark III. It's just unbelievable. I really... Oh, I don't want it. Okay. Um, well, I need more fuel. And I would not mind... See, the med bay is preferable to me to the clone bay, because the clone bay, when they die, they, you know, the clone bay basically only heals when you jump. Because the med bay, you can fully heal someone up. There's another store, I don't have to worry about this. Let's jump somewhere into room, though, so that I can... Ah, no, let's just go straight there. If there's something good, I can always come back. Oh, 
Lovely. What is there? No guns. There is... Oh, there's mind control, though. Mind control is fun. Let's double check. There's not a third store before I... Okay, yeah, let's go for that. Why not? And some more fuel. You, seriously, the amount of fuel you need late game is, is slightly ridiculous. Did I buy the wrong thing? Well, god damn it. Um, okay. Now we need to get a lot more scrap. Oh, why did I... How d... I'm not awake. I shouldn't be playing this game when I'm not awake. Ah. Uh... Oh, well, screw... Oh, hello. Obvious tactic. And let's fire on everything. Oh, why did I buy the drones? I wanted mind control. Mind control is so good and drones are so... Eh. <sighs> oh, well. He's gonna shoot missiles at me and they're gonna hurt. Because that's a breach missile launcher. It's really gonna sting. Unless it misses. I'm okay with this compromise. Alright. As soon as the teleporter's back off cooldown. Ah, uh, come on! Uh-oh. Oh, that stung a little bit. No real downside. Alright, let's just beam in and start breaking it by hand. Go after the shields whilst we're waiting. Actually, there's really no reason to shoot at them. I've got a maxed out gunner. And their weapons will be down soon enough. That's annoying. Um, you know what, Walker, you should probably get some repair skill. Go, go fix that, would you? Be a good chap. Oh, shiny. See how their combat skill is improving? That's just... Oh, it's so good. And now they're going to break their shields and earn even more of the combat pointage. Hell, I might actually take Translator out of the room just so that... Oh. Uh, oh. We won too quickly. That's a shame. Oh, well. And we actually... Oh, wow, they hurt me a lot. Okay, we may need to repair up at some point. Uh, but I don't have any money because I bought a stupid damn drone system. Why did I buy a drone system? Oh, man. I can do a round trip and come back to the store, I think. God damn it. It's rare for the slugs to stay exposed in open space for long periods. Hmm. See, he has a mind control system. He mind controlled George. I'm not happy about that. I'm going to go break it. Is... Yeah, I'm going to go break it. But first we'll break their oxygen supply. Actually, let's go after that. Because honestly, their weapons are no threat to me. But that mind control is annoying. <laughs> Fun thing about this, George gets some repair skill. <laughs> These guys get lots and lots of combat skill. Oh yeah. Oh, there we go. Beautiful. Let's be careful not to blow up the ship whilst my crew's still on it, like I've done in the past. Who did they mind control this time? They mind control Walker. Okay, that's not such a big deal. Come on, Valeria. You need to get your combat skill up. Keep breaking those guns. Beautiful. Good job. Uh, actually, yeah, you can easily win that fight. Fantastic. That was actually quite a bit of scrap and fuel. Uh, let's have you back. 
Oh, wasn't bad. I really don't need a system repair drone. Why did I click on the wrong goddamn button? Uh, no, no, no. I should really, <laughs> I should really wait for my boarding party to heal up before I jump on. Beautiful. Alright. We can do this, guys. I believe. We can earn enough money to buy the mind control and... Ooh, what? You find a slag... A slag... Vessel? Well, soon. Uh, a slug vessel broadcasting distress... Ah, uh, yes. We're having problems with our oxygen generation unit. Perhaps your crew can assist in repairs. I am very familiar with this, and he has three shields, so I'm going to go for the blue option here. Which is, have my mantis oversee the repairs. Once on board, it becomes clear that nothing is wrong with their O2 system. Almost expecting this, your mantis calmly responds to the trap. Once a couple of the slugs have been spread across the walls of their ship. <laughs> the rest surrender. Good job, Lang. Ah, oh, my security chief over there. Pulling his weight. Lovely. Lots and lots of scrap from that. I don't think we can get to the store in time, but that's a shame. Oh, well. Oh, finally we found a an ion storm. Okay. Uh, what we're going to do is beam aboard that, obviously. And take one point out of my shields. Two points out. And put them in there. And we're just going to have to trust our evasion to keep us alive for this. We don't have weapons. And the problem is, every system we turn off, they'll turn on a different one. But I'm not really worried about their fire beam. If they turn on the fire beam and that ion, then we're in trouble. They have... Oh, crap, they've got a med bay. So this is not going to end well for me. Um, Thinking... Like, we, we can make sure that they can't fix this oxygen supply. But, okay, I've got to beam these guys back and heal them up. Which means I have to take a point out of there and put it in there. Okay. Please stop shooting at me. I don't like it. Okay, they should be running low on oxygen. Oh, that was a fire beam. That was a fire beam. Okay. Speaking of running low on oxygen. All right. Um, we just, we just got to stick to the plan. Mr. Moa, I need you to double check. No, that room is not on fire. So I need to conserve all the oxygen we can. I may as well. Never mind, there's no oxygen in there. That was a dumb idea. Uh, Mr. Moa, back to your post. Mr. George, get the hell over there. Alright. Go suck the air out of that room. Right now, and break it. Break it thoroughly. Good. Now, see, yeah, that. He can't, they can't actually fix the oxygen room. They'd have to send in two crew members to do it. Lovely. Come on. Hopefully Valyria gets the last hit. But I'm not really willing to leave her in the room on our own. Okay. I'm gonna take a wild guess that their remaining crew is in the med bay, trying to weather the storm. So here's what we're gonna do. Valeria, who needs a bit of combat skill, is gonna break their shields. I'm then gonna put some points into my burst laser and do what we do best. 
Below them the fu- Actually, am I? Because I could just send in these two guys. Like, the medbay will keep them alive? But probably not healthy, given they have no oxygen on their ship. Ah, oh, beautiful. Um... Excuse me, Mr. Translate. Poke your head in, see how healthy they are. Very. Okay. Guys, come, come, come back home. All right. Mr. Moa, George, can can you guys just heal up whilst we're waiting to, you know, figure out what we're doing? Right, you can go back over there. You can go back over there. You two need to go in there. Meanwhile, we don't really actually need our shields on. Um. Oh, we do need the med bay. All that. Um, I mean, I could, I could have been using the burst laser the whole time, to be honest. But now I'll just teleport these guys back over. Finish them off. Because, yeah, they're not going to last long. The med bay is keeping them stable. Not, not healthy. <laughs> Oh, beautiful. We have so many supplies now. Alright, you guys get back over here. Let's jump the fuck out. Uh, let's maybe wait for you to heal up first before we jump out. Oh, I do love a good boarding team. Alright. To the distress beacon! I suspect I'm not going to get to... I know I'm not going to get to the store in time. You, Oh, a slug ship in the middle of boarding a disabled rock freighter. I think we'll stop them. Oh. What? That's it? Okay. I, okay. I was expecting a fight or, or something. Well, you find a bat... Ooh, you find a battle between... You find two heavily damaged ships floating nearby the remains of a battle. Begin to harvest some use usable debris when you hear the sounds of someone beaming aboard, followed by the shouts for boarding party. You have really boarded the wrong ship, guys. I mean, we got enough, you know, we got a boarding party of our own. We got a head of security as a mantis. I mean, this, this is not going to end well for you. That said, let's take it to the med bay, shall we? Alright. Oh, I didn't want him to break that system. That's a shame. Oh, well. Means Moa has something to do. Because every time a system gets broken, you lose one hull point. Um, up here. Which is sort of a pain in the ass, but yeah, makes sense. Alright, beautiful. You three, heal the hell up. I hope you don't mind suffocating a little just whilst you Lovely. Let's get the hell out of here. I really need to find a store. We are doing well for scrap. All right. Uh, fuck yeah, we're, ooh. We're going to intervene and defend. But I'm not happy about it. <laughs> Okay, beam aboard and power to all of my systems as quickly as we can. Alright, they locked my doors. That's actually not such, such a big deal. We need to disable their weapons, like, right now. Oh, don't mind about these two, but that one, that one needs to not be active. Come on, break it, break it, break it. Oh, it's an ion. Oh, thank goodness. Hmm. Right. Um, actually, I don't care if you break that. Come on back, lads. See, they're going to slowly repair up the weapon system whilst I'm not there. So, as soon as this is back up and active, I'm going to teleport in, disable their shields, so I can start shooting them. Is um yeah, I can't get through three layers of shields. Tiny downside of my my plan is that I need more guns. 
Why do I not have enough guns? It's a terrible tragedy. I'm half tempted to send Walker actually. Get him some combat skill. But no, no, let's not, let's not do any more slow and steady tactics, shall we? Just stick to the classics. Break and enter, suck the oxygen out of it, and murder everyone inside. Except my crew. Really want to be ready to beam them out the moment I can. Alright. Lovely. I'd say we're doing well. Oh. So, ladies and gentle sirs, what do you think? What is this, Sector 4 or 5? And we've got three augments, one weapon, a full crew with a boarding party and a teleporter and a drone bay. Um, and yeah. I really, really wish I had the mind control. Why? Did I really click on the wrong thing? Am I not that? Oh, I should go sleep. But no. The journey must finish. So, ladies and gentlemen, sirs, thank you very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this weird episode. Uh, as always, please like and comment below and sub subscribe if you want to see more. I'm Blizznap, and this is FTL and the Voyage of the Doom Mower.